Hello, my name is Reese, also known as Gold Banana. Today we're going to do some StarCraft story time. Hmm, <laughs> yes. <laughs> it's, uh, where I tell stories about my life. And you guys watch some StarCraft footage, huh? Yes. And today, we're going to talk about a common topic that's happened a lot in my life. And that is peeing next to teachers. Now, teachers, for some reason, don't have their own special bathrooms. All the schools I went to, they've never had a special ass bathroom to go pee in. Girls might, but the dudes, <laughs> they just come to your bathroom. So, like after class, before class, before school, you know, you take a piss. And you have a chance, the chance isn't the biggest, but you might have them go to the urinal and there might be a teacher there. Alright? <laughs> now, this has happened to me on three different occasions. And we're going to go through those occasions. <laughs> Yeah, right now. The first time this happened to me is probably the most embarrassing time this has ever happened. Now, this is elementary school. Third grade. I go into the bathroom. It's recess time, and I don't want to go out to recess with a full bladder because we're going to play some football. So I go to the, the bathroom. I just go and pee in the urinal, you know. And the urinals in elementary school are very small so that little kids can pee in them. And it was always kind of creepy. You know, because the big kids come in, and they can see over, and they can look down at your wang-wang really easily. But we just get past that here. So I come into the urinal. You know, I go in and piss, right? And there's three urinals. So so then a teacher comes in. He's actually not just a teacher. He's the principal. His name is Mr. Thane. He is the principal of our school. All right? <laughs> so I go in, and I'm just pissing. I'm doing my own business. Mr. Thane walks in, and he comes up right next to me. There, like I said, there's three urinals. No, 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 Reed. He's got to go right next to me, all right? And it's one of those those times where you kind of get surprised. You're like, oh, shit. Mr. Thane's right next to me, you know? Because he's, he's a little bit intimidating guy. He's the principal. So I'm just pissing my way, and then I get kind of scared. I'm like, oh, fuck. And during that time, I jerked to the side. Now, if you're a man, if you ever jerked to the side when you're peeing, you know what happens. I... <laughs> I pissed on the side of his body. I got, I pissed the side of his leg on his dress pants he was wearing. And I tried to act like nothing happened there. <laughs> and he kind of, he kind of played it off like nothing happened. So I just jerked to the side and I pissed on his leg and I basically turned back and I just went straight down and did not look at him. Alright? I just did not look at him. And then he, it's, I don't even know if he started peeing it. I, I don't know. He instantly just put whatever it was back in his pants and walked out. <laughs> he didn't acknowledge the fact that I peed on him or anything like that. He just walked out. And to this date, I, could, I don't I don't like talking to him because I know in the third grade I pissed on him. I, I pissed on the side of his leg. <laughs> oh, my God. It was times, you know. I've never told anybody that. I <laughs> All right, the next time was about seventh grade. I think it was seventh grade. And during seventh grade, I had a... Mr. Andrews was his name. He was a science teacher. Mr. Andrews was a very tall man, like six foot two, and he was just a weird guy. He was a weird son of a bitch. All science teachers are weird son of a bitch, but this guy was weird as hell. And he was at the end of his retirement. I think he retired the year after I left. He was an old dude starting to lose it, you know. So, and that, the the urinals there, they had no walls, the no setup walls, you know. So, and there's like a five urinal wall. You know, these were shit urinals. They're terrible urinals. And they're kind of urinals that look like you could take a shit in them. Because they're kind of bullish. So you have to, like, piss, like, all the way back. Like, a couple feet back to aim in. <laughs> that kind of toilet. The worst kind. And they didn't even have the little grooves in the side. If you're a woman, you don't really know what I'm talking about. The, the urinals, the, the crapper-looking urinals have little grooves. So you can piss in them from afar. Just, <laughs> I don't know. I don't know who did that design. So there's, like, five urinals. And I choose the middle one. I don't know, I'm kind of a dick, you know. In seventh grade, I was pretty big douchebag. So they uh, you all this testosterone. So I checked the, just the right in the middle one, you know. I'm just, I get in there, and I have a full bladder. So I just start pissing away. And then Mr. Andrews comes up, and it's another one of those occasions, occurrences where he just comes up and stands right next to you. I don't know why teachers do that. They come up right next to you. They could go to the left, go to the right. But no, he comes right next to me. And this time, it wasn't like an ignorement agreement here. It was, he looks me right in the eyes. <laughs> he looks me right in the eyes as we're pissing. And we have one of those pissing conversations. 
pissing conversations are not not the best. And like I said, I had a full bladder, so I was pissing there for a long time. And he was an old man, so it took his pee a while to come out. But I was I sat there for like twenty felt like twenty five, thirty seconds there, pissing next to my teacher. Talking. That was one of the most awkward conversations I've ever had. Alright? He didn't just talk about science or my grades or anything. We had like a personal conversation. We bonded with that piss thing right there. Just a huh. One hell of a thing. The last one was a very recent occurrence. A pissing occurrence. This is all relevant right here. Alright? I go to the bath. It's before school. Alright? Just, be, you know, before school. And I go to the bathroom. And I walk up to the urinals. And there's like four or three urinals in a row. And they're kind of spaced out. And I see two teachers. This is this is the mother load when it comes to pissing teachers. Two teachers. And I really have to go. And I'm not going to look like a pussy and go to the toilet. Because these are two manly kind of teachers, I guess you can say. One's a science, one's a math teacher. All right? And there, there's three urinals. And there's one right here and one right here. So there's a middle space. There's a middle space between those two. All right? That's the only place to go. All right? Now this... <laughs> <laughs> this is one hell of a piss I go in. So I go in, and I, I, I kind of hesitate first, because I walk in, I'm like, oh, fuck. There's two teachers right there. So I'm not, I kind of get hesitant here. And then one of the teachers, he's my, the math teacher, comes up and says, hey, Reese. So I don't, <laughs> don't want to just not do it. Just walk out the door or just stand back and wait. If you stand back and wait, you're total pussy. So I just, he says, hey, and I say, hey, and I walk in there, and I start pissing. All right? And then, both teachers double-team talk to me. Now, I don't know where to look. Now, Mr. Inch is a very tall guy, alright? My math teacher is a very tall guy. I don't know where to look, alright? So, I, I accidentally take a little glance down at his, you know what? And it was <laughs> one hell of a talk. Just, oh my god. That, that, I think that was just, that was the weirdest time. If you, that was the weirdest piss occurrence that's ever happened. Ever. It was... The sounds of three men pissing. Two older, very tall men. Uh, and I'm I'm eye height with the schlongs. Alright? <laughs> oh, oh, that was awkward. That was awkward. And those were the cases of pissing next to teachers. I don't know if you guys ever experienced this before. If you have, put it in the comments. I would love to hear it, actually. If, <laughs> if this has ever happened. Is it... Like, is it a normal thing to piss at teachers or even piss on the side of your teacher's legs? Is this a common occurrence? If it is, share that out in the comments. It's just, I feel like it, it makes awkward situations. I feel like they should actually have designated places to piss. And times they should piss with the less, least amount of talking to students. And if you are going to take a piss, you know, <laughs> don't talk to your student, alright? <laughs> okay? Alright. Thank you guys for watching. My name is Reese. This has been StarCraft Storytimes. I'm out of here.